Hey everybody, this is Jason with Lone Star Catfish. So I'm out here on the lake. Already got one fish in the boat. Um, it's about 7.15, um, sunrise out here. So uh, got my wife out here today with me. We've uh, got the kayaks lashed together. So we're gonna kind of do a little tandem fishing. Um, before I could even do the intro, I already got one in the boat. So the skunk is off. She's got a hit. I think I've got another one hitting on this other one. So I think it's gonna be an interesting morning and uh, hopefully we'll get a lot of action. So we'll see you in a little bit. All right. That is perfect fish for eating. Yeah. <laughs> see that? Oh, okay. Go ahead. Deal with that in a minute. Oh my god. He's Good. not even really hooked. I mean, it's like under. I don't know how he managed to do that. Feisty little channel cat. All right, you. That's how mine was. Bad channel cat. This is our problem. That is. I see. I've got thin between these fingers. This one under. And the idea is to get the palm. He's pushing up. You guys get that like that. And then, you know, these, you just have to rotate these out. That's more the size of a one right there. That's a good. All right, you know, buddy, I'm gonna let you have that. I'm gonna let you have that. You see, he's got the bait right in his mouth. I'm gonna let him have that. He's such a good boy. All right, go back, tell your friends. Come get some more.
will take it and bend the rod over. These are little fish who are just grabbing it with their mouth. A lot of channels in here right now. Little tiny mouths can't get the hook and the bait in their mouth, so it's really just stealing the bait. I think we might uh, try to slide down this down this side of this uh, little island right here and see if we can't find where the blues may be holding, if they're holding in here at all. So. Closer to what we're looking for. Still not quite there, but at least we found some blue cats. All right, off you go. It's a blue though. Are bigger than the fish. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> That's what we're waiting for right there. itself out. Okay. It's going to get around my anchor. I'd go, I'd go a little looser on the drag. That was a lot looser, but that's fine. He's got, he's got this line tangled up. 
see if I can get it. Okay, I need to get this out of the way. All right, now you can go. Hey, you promise you've got it so loose you're not gonna be able to reel. So reel back. Okay, now don't don't go so far back that you tighten it up to where when he goes he breaks it. You know what I'm saying? So loosen it up a little bit. You have to go in small increments. Well, you got to tire him out right this second. That's okay. Easy. It's kind of wrapped around it. E okay. Nope, nope. That, that, that's fine. Let, let, let some drag out. Just a little bit, not too much. Okay, now lift him up. Got this anchor here. Right, go ahead and reel. Reel. Okay, you gotta have to tighten the drag. Okay, alright. Easy, easy, easy. Easy. Loosen the drag. Loosen the drag. Okay. Now, try to lift. Just, just lift. It's okay. It's okay. Try to reel if you can. Easy, just gonna lift. Easy, this is this is where they're gonna break it. If he's gonna break it. your hand further back. No, it won't. You got you got his hand there. There you go. Nice. Bad. I think he's got one. No, I guess not. Fix that. Okay. Not too bad. Back you go. Huh? I don't have time to deal with that right now. I got you, buddy. I got you. I got you, buddy. Adam, baby. Beautiful.
<laughs> not bad. I ain't an Amy fish. Yeah. <laughs> but that's not too bad. What do you think? That's about 25 maybe? Something like that. into our boat position here. There we go. All right, buddy. We're just going to check you out here real quick. About 23 on the number. It's not bad. Thank you very much, Mr. Blue Cat, for coming to see me. You're welcome. <laughs> Let go! Open your gun butt. Open. Open. Sometimes it Look at it. I'm sorry, Miss Amy. I'll never touch you again, please. I'll never go again. Why are you torturing me so? <laughs> I'm hanging from the gallows. Shut up. God damn it. You're teasing me. It's like torture. I think I'm going to get away. <laughs> Fixing to throw this fish at you. You know, those don't count as multiple fishes caught. <laughs> How many things are you going to come up with to say, huh? This is awesome. I can't, I can't believe I haven't been filming this. I can't believe. If you do, I'm going to pop you. Yay! You see, I only turned it on when you did it the last time. So we'll edit it to make it look like you know what you're doing. <laughs> you suck so bad. Well, I think I've had this fish on this line for about five minutes. <laughs> he just is so small, couldn't do anything. So, no wonder none of those big returns were hitting me. Because I already had a fish on the line. So, a little channel cat. And that's what we were dealing with earlier in the day. Um, you know, we slid up and down uh, this bank right here. And we were able to, to come across a couple really good blues. Um, so, definitely wise um, to, to start moving like we did. Um, so, like I said, I'm just going to throw a couple more lines out here. Um, see what I can land here in the last couple minutes. All right, boys. One more nice blue. I'll take a nice to golly whopper blue. Maybe. Maybe. Borderline of nice. Not bad for the last fish on that rod. Not the best in the world, but I will take it. Okay, everybody. Um, I'm just about to call it a day. Got about nine or ten more minutes, and then I'm going to head out. Uh, Amy's already on her way back. Uh, she's getting a head start because she's feeling a little tired and doesn't feel like she can paddle as fast as me, and that's fine. Um, camera was going on and off on me today. Um, caught, you know, the one big fish that, that Amy caught. Um, I did catch on the GoPro, I hope, um, but I did not catch it, I don't believe, on uh, the forward camera here. So it's a little disappointing, but it uh, would have been a lot more disappointing had I caught that fish and not had that camera running. So. Um, I guess there's a silver lining there. So, so big fish of the day, 30 and a half inches, uh, beautiful blue cat. 
Um, you know, she caught that on 15 pound test. Uh, she had another one on, I think, easily as big of that, as big as that. Uh, but we didn't really properly reset her drag when she put it in, and unfortunately, it took off, put the tip of the pole in the water, and snapped. So that was disappointing, but it's my fault for not uh, having to reset that drag. And I really just need to put heavier line uh, on that reel. She likes those spin casts, so I get those for her, and they come with whatever they've got, 15 pound and I don't bother messing with it, um, but I will now that we've lost a big fish. So um, it was a good day. It was a beautiful day, not a cloud in the sky. Um, it's cool. We're kind of in and out of the shade right here. So, you know, it's gone from kind of warm out in the uh, sun to nice and cool in the shade. Finishing off with a bunch of dink taps right here. Every once in a while, uh, the rod will bury itself, but mostly it's dinks. There's a lot of gar rolling out here. Um, and based on the bites that I'm seeing where the line just sort of goes out and it comes back and goes out and comes back Those are gar. They're just grabbing the bait. They're swimming off as soon as they feel a little resistance. They let it go um, And that's just the way gar like to bite. So um, I think that's about it. Boy, I sure see some activity on this scope. So I wish a couple of these uh, big red uh, returns right here would bury my rod, but um, Like I said, I I've got just a few more minutes here and I'm gonna put it back up and I'm going to catch up to her. She's already, uh, she's, she's making pretty good progress. So hopefully I'll be able to catch up to her about the time she gets to shore. We'll load up, get to the house, grab uh, kind of a late breakfast, early lunch, and go watch some college football. So it was a good day. Um, her maiden voyage out on the kayak fishing. So I'm glad we were able to put her on a big fish. Um, and that's it. We were going to try to do this again next weekend. Actually, no, we're not going to do this next weekend. Uh, maybe another week after that. Uh, and then uh, we'll see you. So that's about all that I've got for you today. Uh, hope you enjoyed it, and uh, we'll see you next time.